All right, after watching a few episodes of FUBAR, I can tell exactly how the show was pitched to Arnold Schwarzenegger, and I can see why he said yes, and as the show progresses, I can also see why he seems to get bored. This show must have been pitched to him as, hey, Arnold, we can do a sequel to True Lies, except we'll do it more expanded in TV form and be able to tell more stories, but hey, it'll still be cinematic, we promise. So let's get to the cinematic part right away. It's not cinematic. It looks like a very lo-fi TV show. There's some bad CGI starting right away in the first episode. Anyway, the first episode actually has some potential. It really does feel like an expansion of the True Lies story in that True Lies world and type of storytelling. It feels like what they might have done with a sequel to that movie. That all sounds good, except for the fact that so many years later, we really need a reason for revisiting this dynamic and we don't get it it's really just simply a attempt at riffing on what james cameron did in that really fun movie there's no new ideas here it's just instead of husband and wife it's father and daughter there's an attempt at a father-daughter dynamic where the father wasn't there for the daughter the daughter ends up walking in the father's footsteps inadvertently because that's what happens but it never gets any deeper than that they play for jokes and the jokes are pretty cringy the first episode works pretty well, but it's a downward spiral after that. I know that some other creators have complained that it's cringy, but the cringy part actually could be fine because it's like dad jokes and Arnold's character is attempting to be that kind of cringy dad. Like he doesn't really know how to be a good father, but he really wants to be. He means well even when he doesn't do well. Um, and, and that all could be really cool, but there's just no depth to it at all. And as far as the humor goes... The show doesn't seem to be self-aware enough. If it was fully aware that it was riffing on 80s and 90s action films, especially Arnold's films, it could be maybe more interesting. Now, I don't really want another series where the actors are winking at the audience, but even if it was just aware enough to be a little sillier, I think it could have been something fun. This thing just misses the target in almost every way, unfortunately. The action doesn't work because it feels cheap, and we don't expect cheap with an Arnold Schwarzenegger project. The comedy doesn't work because it's not fresh or new, and it doesn't ever go deep enough or show us anything special that we haven't seen before. The only thing I will say is in the first few episodes, Arnold seems to be really having a good time, and I think that's pretty fresh and fun. But as the show progresses, he seems to be getting bored. You can literally feel it in his performance. If you look at episode one versus further on in after the halfway point, you can tell he's just kind of gotten bored, and who could blame him? Because the conversations between the two main actors here repeat themselves over and over and over again. It's like, oh, you were a bad dad. Oh, I'm sorry for being a bad dad. It really never has no depth. The, you know, action sequences are just there as filler almost. They don't have any impact or long-term effects. It's just, you know, bullet list type of stuff. It's like, okay, have the action scene. Next bullet. Have the dramatic scene. Next bullet. Have the comedy scene. This thing just isn't special, and that's unfortunate because this is Arnold's first TV project, and I was hoping it would be great. I kind of knew it wouldn't be just because it's on Netflix. Let me know what you think if you watch any of FUBAR. Let's talk about it.